love here welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new to my channel be sure to hit that subscribe button and be part of the squad join the squad we need you you're definitely welcome here guys i'm very excited about today's video and you should get excited too because it's going to be a good time i have my very first wig review video so grab some popcorn grab some tea because we're going to spill all the tea when it comes to this wig let's go so the wig i'm reviewing today is the Autre lace front wig and the style is nisha this is how the packaging looks i didn't even take out the wig yet because i want you guys to see everything with me and a disclaimer i am not paid to do this video guys by the way i ordered this wig on sisterwigs.com they didn't contact me and sent me the wig definitely paid this wig and i have some receipts okay so this is going to be a very honest opinion because I spent my coins on the wig. Now, I love for my hair to be a 1B because that's my natural hair color. So this is the reason why I picked the 1B. But they have this hair available in many, many different colors. And it says here that this wig is heat resistant to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. And by the way, I've been eyeing this wig for a really long time now. I've been watching YouTube videos about it. And I was like, you know what? I really, really want to get this wig. And then it was only $35 on sisterwigs.com. So I had to grab it. A sister had to bring it home because it's lit. It's nice. Okay, we're going to open the wig and see the beautifulness. Okay, so it has the usual stuff that we don't we don't need that anyways this is take a picture of this guys if you're using your phone take a screenshot because this is what you're gonna need to look at if you go at the beauty supply to get it by the way i definitely recommend you guys to get this wig online because it was 45 dollars at my local beauty supply and it was only 35 dollars on sisterwigs.com so save your coins with me and it comes with the usual net we don't need that either and then it has some other protective stuff on the inside of the wig and then this is the wig itself so so far it's a true 1b it doesn't look like a but what's the name like a jet black it's a off black which is a 1b which is what my natural hair color is and I really appreciate that because when you get wigs online, you're kind of scared because you're like, oh, what if the 1B is more like a 1? No, 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 no. This is a 1B and it is a 1B, okay? <laughs> also, the, the other thing I'm noticing about the wig is that the lace part is hard. Not too hard, but it's not like the really soft ones that's going to peel off. You know what I mean? This one is like, it looks like it's going to secure, like, you know, it's going to stay secure on your edges so this is definitely what we need i'm also noticing that it has two combs on the side and a third larger comb at the back it also has the um the elastic band if you want it to be tighter but i don't usually use those because even like a wig cap i don't usually use that either because i get a lot of headaches when i do that and that's very annoying also the the parting of the of the wig let's look at the parting of the wig you definitely have that parting space on the inside of the wig so if you wanted to go ahead and pluck some hairs out you can definitely do that because you have that parting space and also the parting is like a l as you guys can see i think the packaging also tells you that is the l parting over here um this wig so far it feels soft it looks like a yaki texture but it's way softer it's more like on the silkier side of a yaki texture it kind of looks like what a natural hair would look like if you were to either blow dry it depending on your hair type or if you were to flat iron it so so far i'm digging this wig it looks really nice it's really long so that's probably gonna reach up to my butt i'm definitely gonna show you guys if it does or not that's if i mean i don't know i've never gotten hair that's really long like that so i may have to chop some off but i don't know yet if i feel like a deep wig, i'm not gonna chop it off you guys this wig is on fleek so far so i'm gonna go ahead 
cut the lace and then try to play around with, with it and then I'm gonna come back and show you guys whether I slay or not. Does she slay or does she not slay? Now that's the real question. Let's go. So I just plopped this wig onto my head. I didn't do anything to it yet. I was about to customize it and I was like, you know what? I want to show you guys how it looks without me doing anything to it so you guys can get an idea. So, I'm not lying guys. The lace is still here. I don't know if you can see that, but I still have the lace. I didn't even cut the lace yet, okay? And this is already the slayage you get from this wig. When I put this wig on my head, the first thing that came to my mind was Instagram baddie. Hashtag instagram baddie that was the first thing that came to my head because this wig this wig that's all i'm gonna say i'm going to turn around so far this is the wig guys and how it's like so long like i'm like five four so you guys can kind of get the picture and this wig is pretty long because the tip of the wig the end definitely reached the top of my butt so it's pretty long and you guys look how nice this wig look i didn't even do anything to it yet so now i'm going to do some things to it to make it look more natural and i'm gonna be right back with you by the way i have a separate video on how i customize this wig i have the link in the description box so don't forget to check it out hey guys so i have played with the hair a little bit i created some baby hairs for it i plucked um I plucked it a little bit, I added some concealer to make it look a bit more natural, and this is the final result. Overall, I give this hair an 8 out of 10, and the only reason why I'm giving it an 8 and not a full 10 is because... This is my first time with this hair. I don't I don't know how it's going to hold. I don't know. So I'm just going to have to wait and maybe do a month review. Hopefully I'll be able to find the time to do that for you guys. Um, but overall, I like the hair. It feels pretty nice, you know. So far I'm running my fingers through it and it feels pretty good. And one thing also I noticed about this hair is that you know how like you get those hair that get that looks really shiny like the synthetic hairs. This one doesn't look shiny at all. Like, you don't have to add baby powders to try to manipulate it, which is awesome. You know, this is great. So, I'll try to do a one-month review for you guys. But overall, the hair is pretty nice so far. And I hope you guys like this video. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I appreciate you taking your time to watch me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye!